After showers pushed through yesterday, thunderstorms impacted the Grand Valley, giving us plenty of rain, but we need it for this time of year as we're relying on that monsoon moisture to get us out of those drought conditions. We're looking pretty good so far and a rainbow to wrap everything up as well yesterday for a beautiful spectacle. Dry air returns today with sunshine in the forecast. We're going to start seeing warmer temperatures as well. A little bit of cloud cover start rolling in this morning, but uh, really chilly temperatures. Well, really chilly. That's my inner Floridian kicking in, but there's upper 50s right now walking out the door. Maybe grab a light jacket as you're headed out the door. Temperatures today just a few degrees shy of what we need to be for this time of year before we see those temperatures where they need to be for this time of year take over tomorrow. 60 degrees as you're walking out the door this morning, getting ready for the school bus and then lunchtime rolling around for some upper 70s, then 80s into the afternoon. But 84 for the high means beautiful temperatures today and cloud coverage continuing to push to the east. We're seeing a little bit of cloud coverage pop up in the Grand Valley. We saw some thunderstorms last night. I heard a crack of thunder around 11 p.m., but now we're seeing clear conditions. We're going to be seeing very slight chances for showers. All these showers are going to be over the higher elevations in the Uncompahgre Plateau and uh, the West Elks. We're going to see some chances for showers, mostly to the higher elevations with dry air taking over in the valleys. Not really expecting to see much. If you see something, very light precipitation will be expected. Don't expect anything for rain today as uh, we're just going to see very slight chances for showers. If you see something, it'll be quick, it'll be light and uh, nothing to really worry about. As we take a look ahead, more sunshine on the way tomorrow as dry air is pushing on in. This is going to give plenty of sunshine to increase temperatures throughout the rest of the week as well. Today, mid 80s in the Grand Valley, lower 80s in the Incapagre Valley, 70s to the higher elevations. Nice temperatures on the way this afternoon. Tonight getting down to the 50s and 40s. This is the coolest temperatures I've seen in quite some time. Uh, so definitely keep this in mind for those cooler temperatures in the overnight. We're seeing uh, increase in temperature right where we need to be for this time of year. These are seasonal average temperatures right here in the upper 80s. This is going to be the case throughout the rest of the week as well for temperatures being right where they need to be. Winds pretty calm this afternoon as well. So honestly looking forward to this afternoon. Lower 80s and uh, calm winds, sunshine. Can't really complain. Drought monitors looking good as well from that rain that we saw this past weekend. Even Palisades kind of creeping out of that drought conditions. So that's awesome for the agricultural aspect of the valley. And uh, as we see the pollen for or tomorrow, let's talk about tomorrow really quick. 50s walking out the door and then later morning hours for 60 degree temperatures and then 80s by noon and the upper 80s this afternoon. As we take a look ahead at that Discovery Auto seven day forecast, nice temperatures in the upper 80s throughout the next seven days, except for today. Mid 80s with sunshine for a beautiful August day.